Good evening, everybody. I'm Fox 17 Chief Meteorologist Kevin Craig. Nice day across the area today. We had plenty of sunshine. Here's the live webcams. Battle Creek, Stanton, Comstock Park, and Muskegon. Sunset not occurring to between 745 and almost 750. So those days uh, continue to get longer. As we look at our live Doppler radar, there's no precipitation out there with the blue sky and just some high, thin cirrus clouds. We'll maintain mostly clear skies, seasonable temperatures overnight, but there are clouds west of the Mississippi River Valley. Those will advance in here very, very gradually overnight. We'll still maintain mostly clear skies, but by the time we go into tomorrow, we'll start uh, our Monday with a little bit of sunshine, but the clouds will gradually thicken throughout the day. Our current temperatures at the dinner hour have us generally in the low to mid 40s. The exceptions here, South Haven and Benton Harbor, both in the upper 30s. Here's our SkyCast HD forecast then for this evening and overnight, mostly clear skies, seasonably cool temperatures where we should be for this time of the year with lows falling into the mid 20s. We'll have a northeast to turning southeast wind at about 5 to 10 miles per hour. The next three days of our weather forecast, we're in the mid 40s for Monday. We'll start with some sunshine, but the clouds gradually thicken throughout the day. And as we get into Monday night and into early Tuesday morning, if you're from Grand Rapids of the north, I can't rule out a rain shower, a couple of snow showers, nothing accumulating there. It'll be very very light if we see that. Uh, otherwise, we'll start Tuesday with some uh, cloud cover. Should see some sunshine through the afternoon, a breezy day with mid 40s. And by Wednesday, the first part of Wednesday looks dry, but by the afternoon and evening, we're going to see some rain developing with temperatures in the mid 40s, and there's more rain as we get into Thursday. We'll talk more about that part of the forecast and how much we think will fall coming up tonight on Fox 17 News at 10 and 11.